So I basically come from Mumbai, born, brought up in Mumbai, and uh, my father, uh, Abba Sedanwala, was basically a CEO of a company, small company, and very hardworking, very honest person. And my mother was a housewife, but again, uh, just to make our ends meet, because in, at those times it was very difficult, though you know, because with very less salary. So we came from a middle class family where my brothers were doing engineering. So to, uh, you know, even for their education fees, my father had to struggle. So when I got out of school and I wanted to go to college, my mother said that you'll have to earn yourself to pay the fees. So I started giving tuitions and that's how I paid my fees for my college. And then I graduated, I did my commerce, I did my law and I also became a company secretary. Uh, I did my uh, professional course in company secretary. Uh, though my father was very keen, I become a chartered accountant. But that, at that point of time, this is in ninth, almost I would say 35 years back, when uh, at that time company secretary was a very new profession and everybody said that it's an upcoming profession, so why don't you do CS? Though I was not very keen on law, but then uh, I slowly got interested and I did it. After that, I did my training with Rallies India, that was in 1988. And then when after my training, I got in as a company secretary, I started working with a company called Mewar Marbles, which is a small company where they wanted to come out of a, for a listing. They wanted to raise money from the public. Uh, it was a small company. Thereafter, I moved on to Ruya Group, which is a big group in Mumbai, as a company secretary. And in 89, after I got married uh, to Hatim, my, and uh, so he basically st was from Hyderabad. So I shifted down to Hyderabad, and since then I'm here. But when I came to Hyderabad, I realized that the job market for CS was not so great. And, um, you know, they were not willing to pay that kind of salaries that I was, I was already drawing in Mumbai. So then I decided that I'll set up my own practice. And, uh, you know, at that time, of course, it was extremely difficult because there were no, uh, very, very few people were in practice as a company secretary and nobody knew what company secretary was. So basically it was like, uh, you know, you had to literally, people thought that company secretary would be like a private secretary to an MD or a CEO, which is not, so as you know, that company secretary basically is a professional who has expertise in company law matters and uh, we provide uh, all the ensuring that all the companies do the compliance of the legal requirements under the law properly. And we are the uh, focal point or maybe the coordinators between the stakeholders, that is the shareholders, the, uh, you know, the government authorities, and the board of directors along with the management. So we help the management uh, to ensure that all the compliances are in place. And we take care of all the, uh, so that, you know, company is in compliant with the laws of the land. So that's what a company secretary does. So I started uh, practices in, as a company secretary. It was extremely difficult. Um, you know, I mean, barely, uh, you know, initially to explain itself, it took a very long time. After that, you know, uh, I set a practice in, uh, from 1990 till about 93. Then my husband was working in Muscat, so I joined him in Muscat and I gave my practice to another colleague and left for Muscat. But somehow I did not find it, uh, you know, very comfortable there and I did not like the job which I was doing there. So I came back and then restarted my practice and that's when I decided to take another, and then I, my, I mean, my baby was born, so I delivered a baby and I could not, uh, you know, I had no support. Uh, as far as my in-laws are concerned or to take care of the baby. So I had to be there at home with the baby and along with that I sat, set up my practice. So literally I used to have my baby on my lap and you know do my practice and I took a trainee that is Raghu Babu who joined me as a trainee and uh, he, he used to sit on the floor because I did not even have a proper table then. And that's how we started our journey and once he completed his training I asked him to become my partner and that's how RNA Associates was formed in 97. Uh, in 97, RNA Associates uh, was born, which is uh, the company which is today, which is now almost 25 years. 
Raghu Babu continues to be my partner and we have grown, we have added more partners. So whoever got trained in RNA and continued, so became partners. So today we are almost uh, four partners and we have another uh, legal firm called uh, Samasti Legal where Prashant is the partner and heads Samasti Legal. So he, uh, you know, it's a separate vertical, but he was also trained in RNA Associates. And we are, you know, from, you know, starting at home, Today we have grown and we are, uh, are operating out of Bigam Pet from a large premise and we have more than almost 60 people working with us so we have slowly and steadily provided employment. We have trained more than 100 company secretaries during this process who are already either in very well placed in either practice or they are working somewhere and doing very well for themselves. So this has been my journey as far as uh, professional journey is concerned and I feel very happy that I have been able to contribute to the society by you know training so many company secretaries and giving them employment or giving them you know opportunity to become entrepreneurs and successful entrepreneurs and uh, uh, you know they are I mean the kind of respect and the kind of uh, uh, you know, I get from all of these people is very heartening and it's very, ha I mean, I'm really happy about that. I have never thought that I would get so much work. I had never imagined that. Uh, but uh, thankfully, because I really got complete support from my husband, uh, he, you know, told me that, you know, come what may, you should, uh, you know, try to achieve whatever you can and give your full potential. So, because of the support, the backup which I got from my husband, from my mother-in-law and you know, also of course from my parents because my parents always believed and trusted in me. They believed that I can, you know, I was capable enough to do things. And not only my parents, even for other matters, like if it comes to family matter matters or anything, they would want to take my advice, you know. So somehow they felt that I had that in me that I would be able to give the right solution to any problem that is there. So that is, you know, that's very satisfying. And, you know, I feel happy that the people trust me. And uh, even all these people, you know, who are joining RNA today, you know, today also people, company secretaries, the students who want to do train, they want to do training in RNA because they feel that RNA will give them that base where they can stand up on their own feet and, you know, be successful. So I, uh, my only principles that I follow is, uh, which I have learned from my father and my mother, is to be very honest, to be dedicated, to ensure that you give the freedom and the independence to the people who are working with you. Uh, give, you know, trust them that they will be able to handle just the way you are handling things. So train them the way, I mean, just the way you would want to work. You train them so that they work the same way. And give them that freedom. Tell them that, yes, you are free to do whatever as long as, you know, of course, mistakes everybody makes. But you own up your mistakes and you ensure that you don't repeat those mistakes, which that has really helped. And today, RNA is one of the largest firms in Hyderabad, having so many people in the sec company secretaries. So my vision was to be like the big four. You have Deloitte's and the chartered accountants, but there's no such large firms under company secretaries. So that's been my vision, and that's how we've grown. And I've added so many partners, and hopefully, you know, keep adding more as we go along. So that's been my vision. That has been my dream. And so far, God has been great, and I have been, you know, able to, uh, you know, grow slowly and steadily. Uh, of course, ups and downs have always been there, but we've always steadily grown, and, you know, people do give a lot of weightage to our firm. There is a lot of, uh, uh, you know, recognition that I have received. So that, that gives you a lot of satisfaction.